James Kaufman, World News Report today. Today is July 7th, 2023, 7-7. God bless you and yours, no matter where you are in the world. Please subscribe, give us a thumbs up, ring that bell for critical future updates. Ladies and gentlemen, we've had a strong M flare directly earth facing. NOAA's calling it a 3.86 class M flare. NASA's calling it a 4M flare. This was directly Earth-facing and originated from sunspot AR-3359. It was picked up by our GOES satellite. It was a short-term flare, although I believe that it was strong enough to expel a coronal mass ejection towards Earth that we should all be looking for in the next 20 to 72 hours, depending on the speeds. All right, heading over to STO, the only place I could find the explosion. Lots of activity. Right there was the explosion, if y'all saw it. And then let's see if we can see it at 171 angstroms. It should happen right about. There it was, I believe. Right there, guys. And that time is going to be around 6.30 UTC time. We're going to watch it again at 193 here. We're on to the 7th right about now. And then we'll see it happen right there. And there's some action also in 3361 to the north right here all day long very active area up here but the big blast is going to be right here there it was so we're able to actually see that at 171 angstroms we'll see if we have any more luck the seventh starting right about now also 3361 up to the top it's active harder to see that what we will do is slow that down going into the seventh here look for and there it was at 171 angstroms we're also again getting a lot of activity from 3361 up here abnormal activity one last time here we will be able to see it below here right about now there it went and jumping back we're going to see it blow there it went perfect we're also seeing a ton of activity from 3361 and coronal holes that are now basically earth facing that could generate solar winds in the next 24 to 48 hours or thereabouts and most unfortunately we missed most of the x-ray absorption the radio alternation. I've been recovering from surgery and slept about 10 hours and I'm not in great shape as we speak, but we'll push through it. Uh, this is the end of the M flare. You can tell by the time there, 6.59. Uh, the peak was right around 6.30 UTC time. Although a short term M4 class solar flare 3359 is definitely earth facing 3361 up here and everyone's talking about 3363 right now they're actually saying that they took pictures of it from nasa available mars satellites now, i don't know if that's true but i'm about to show y'all that in the next story god bless each and every one of you guys let's get ready to rumble it's going to be a very tough 120 days. Share, subscribe, and always remember anything's possible in Bizarro World.